Hi, I'm Liz Fletcher. I'm 34 years old. I am five foot seven and I live in Georgetown, Kentucky. I haven't heard from either of you since I was diagnosed. It's like I don't exist to either of you. Yet, let me understand this fully. You find out I was on television. No. What you want is to take any focus from me and put it on you, Mom. It's who you are and always have been. You can't stand it when the attention is not on you. And oh, do I know the consequences of that burden from both of you. And Dad, you're worse than Mom for going along with her lies and not believing me and punishing me and not protecting me from her? Why? How dare you show up and want to meet the cameraman and the news station and Blake and my staff and my doctor and... No! I am not a child anymore and you can't control me and you're not getting any attention. Why no mother of mine is welcome in our home. Now leave and only contact me again if your intentions are pure and loving. You may have to drink on that, huh, mom and dad? You won't beat me, cancer. You hear me? I'll be walking and hiking and playing and typing and working again. Hello? Hi, Dr. X. So, um, when do I start uh, brain radiation to kill the cancer tumors in my brain? I, I do? Okay. I'll uh, wait for the neurosurgeon's office to call me. I appreciate it. Yes, I'll stay sunshiny. Thank you. Yep, you too. Bye. Craig, hi honey, are my prescriptions ready yet? Okay, please, please hurry home. I have to have brain surgery tomorrow. Okay, I'll see you soon. I love you loads. Why? Haven't I been through enough already? I can do this. I have faith in you, God and Jesus. This is simply another bump in the road I will conquer. I know 
that there is a reason and a plan and everything. And I know that it will all be revealed in your perfect timing. 